We are given the ellipse x square upon a square plus y square upon b square is equal to 1. Let's start by plotting this ellipse on the Cartesian plane. Now we need to find the area of the largest rectangle that can be drawn within this ellipse. Let's assume that one of the corners of the rectangle that lies on the ellipse in the first quadrant has the coordinates a cos phi, b sin phi. Therefore, the coordinates of the other corners of the rectangle are a cos phi minus b sin phi minus a cos phi b sin phi and minus a cos phi minus b sin phi. Therefore, it follows that the length of the sides of the rectangle are 2b sin phi and 2a cos phi. Therefore, the area of the rectangle A is equal to 2a cos phi times 2b sin phi, which can be written as 2ab times sin 2 phi. Now, the first derivative of A with respect to phi is equal to 4ab cos 2 phi. Now, the area is maximum or minimum when the first derivative of a with respect to phi is equal to 0. And therefore, 4ab cos 2 phi is equal to 0 or cos 2 phi is equal to 0, which implies that 2 phi is equal to pi upon 2, which implies that phi is equal to pi upon 4. Now, the second derivative of a with respect to phi is equal to minus 8ab sine 2 phi and at phi is equal to pi upon 4, this is equal to minus 8ab sine pi upon 2, which is equal to minus 8ab, which is clearly negative. Therefore, the area of this rectangle is maximized when phi is equal to pi upon 4. And it therefore follows that the area of the largest rectangle that can be drawn within this ellipse is equal to 2ab sine 2 phi, where phi is equal to pi upon 4, which is equal to 2ab times sine pi upon 2, which is equal to 2ab. And this is the required answer.